you, Pisces. How are you? Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rise, and Sign. Hello. Oh, who? Um, um, a brick is here for uh, messages here for you, Pisces. Okay, Pisces, there's a lot of opportunities, a lot of offers is going to be coming up for you, Pisces. Whatever that um, happened, there is a lot of opportunities that is going to be coming up for you, Pisces. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's get in the reading and let's check out and see what is happening. Okay. So I want to say to each and every person, this is the third week, the energy of the tower coming down, justice. Okay. If you guys were doing, um, or if you were having issue with others, okay, whatever that was transpiring, if you were having issue with others, listen, ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be resolved in this week. Okay. So I'm seeing that a couple or relationships is going to be good because whatever that was blocking, affecting both of you, it's coming down because justice is protecting you. Justice is protecting you. So whatever that was blocking and affecting you, justice comes up and it's going to be protecting both of you. Okay. So you could be in a relationship and people, um, are intervening in your relationship and people are, um, have been, um, you know, instructing you your relationship and that sort of a thing, justice is coming in and they are seeing the truth of what was going on and they're going to be protecting you from what has been happening. Okay. So that is a message for someone out there. Um, ladies and gentlemen, I want to say thank you. Please like and share these videos. And thank you to all the Pisces. I am going to be definitely doing some giveaway for you Pisces. Okay. Um, because you guys have rock last week. You guys have over the thousands. So please share, like, and share this Pisces. I love you so much. All right, Pisces. This is the third week is the week of the sun. Remember your water sign. You're very emotional, but you're one of the best people um when you're vibrating on a positive energy oh my god but um you know life is full of surprises and you know you guys are the lovers trust me but uh, you know sometimes life comes and happen in a mysterious way the week begin 16 until 22nd let's see pisces what's coming up for the pisces in the third week it's going to be a week where you're going to be finding out things spices okay so get ready for that oh yeah and you're going to be finding out something about an uh an aquarius gemini or libra some unexpected news is coming in for you pisces okay some unexpected news is going to be coming in for you pisces but you're going to be receiving some help whatever is transpiring definitely help is going to be coming in help could be coming in from a taurus help come could be coming in from a taurus okay seven of pentacles oh my god money is coming in for you um guys what is happening is it end of month some of you are going to be walking away and turning your back on a taurus some of you are going to be walking away and turning your back on a taurus if you're in a relationship with a taurus you're going to be walking away and turning your back on a taurus okay Whatever the issue is and whatever the situation is, I'm seeing you because some unexpected information is going to be coming out about a Taurus. You're going to be walking away and turning your back on a Taurus, okay? The Five of Cups is here, and the energy of the Five of Cups is that you're dealing with a Pisces. So you Pisces, here again, um, you Pisces are definitely um, turning your backs moving some of you Pisces are going to be moving towards a Pisces you're going to be turning your back on a Taurus and moving towards a Pisces and um, some of you are going to be moving towards a scorpion okay Wow so we have the Taurus and the scorpion there was something that uh, um mm, 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 mm. Wow ladies and gentlemen Ooh, an Aquarian and a Taurus Pisces watch out for an Aquarian and a Taurus these two people are not really nice so watch out for an Aquarian and a Taurus 
because these two people are not nice. Here is the Aquarian. Okay. Aquarian and a Taurus, be careful. Okay. Aquarian and a Taurus, be careful for these Aquarian and these Tauruses. Okay. Um, they could be in alignment working against you. An Aquarian and a Taurus could be in alignment working against you. Information is going to be coming out. These two or unexpected information is going to be coming out. Okay. And this unexpected information has to do with a Scorpio. So unexpected information about a Scorpion is definitely going to be coming out. The six of cups is here and this is good because this is the energy of a Scorpion. Whatever is happening, ladies and gentlemen, to a Scorpion, you gotta be careful because a scorpion, some unexpected news about the scorpion, but you have a strong, strong foundation. Wow. You definitely have a strong foundation. All right. So a scorpion, some of you are dealing with an Aquarius and a scorpion, whatever they have done, you have had a strong foundation. They could have stolen your information. That is what I'm getting that an Aquarius and a scorpion, these are young people between the ages of 18 and 45 could have stole your information. They're working with a Taurus, but what I'm, what I'm receiving is that jail time for all of them. Jail time is coming up for all of them because they could, uh, unexpected information is going to come out that these people have stolen your information. Um, so the Taurus could be the big boss, and this Aquarius person is a younger person, but a liar and a thief. And, um, and this scorpion, but I'm seeing jail time coming up for them. There we go. Three of pentacles. So unexpected news is either about money that they've stolen, but it has to do with a, a Capricorn. Okay. So some unexpected news, a Capricorn is going to be giving you an unexpected news about an Aquarius, a Taurus that is going to be doing something, but you stand strong because you have uh, the four of ones and you stand strong because you stand strong over whatever has transpired because I'm seeing some legal issue. News is going to be coming in. News could be coming in from a Capricorn that is going to be letting you know what has, has transpired. The end is coming to a Taurus. The end is a coming to a Taurus and there could be transition. So you might be in a relationship with a Taurus, unexpected news is going to be coming out. Okay. And you, it has something you're ending a relationship with a Taurus. Some of you, this is the ending and a new beginning is coming in. Okay. So you're ending a relationship with a Taurus and you're looking for better water. Some deceptiveness that has transpired by a scorpion is going to be coming out. Okay, some deceptiveness by an Aquarius and a Scorpion is going to be coming out, and they could be seeing serious jail time. They could be seeing serious jail time. The truth of a situation is finally going to be coming out because something that you weren't seeing now you're going to be seeing the truth, and it has to do with a Scorpion. Now you're going to be seeing the truth because you weren't seeing the truth. And if you notice judgment comes out where it's as if they're bellering down unexpected news, judgment comes out, they're bellering down and they're going to be telling you what a scorpion and Aquarius has done. And it has to do something with financial stability and family financial stability. And I think these two people were either, if you are the father or the stepfather, they were trying to steal your information so that they could receive the financial abundance or your property or um, whatever financial things is it. But this scorpion is connected to you, whether in past life, which is could be a soul family and an issue that comes back. Um, this scorpion could be connected with you as a, as a son or a stepson or whatever. But, um, you know, his, you're going to be victorious and successful because you're going to be triumphant over this. You're going to be triumphant over there. saying you're going to be victorious and successful. Whoever the star, this, this Taurus is, uh, 
Um, the Taurus is going to either go to jail. A end is coming to this situation. The lies and the deception, and it is created by and Pisces and Aquarian, uh, Pisces and Aquarians between the ages of eighteen and forty-five. What they were doing is either accessing your information, taking your letter, taking your information, taking your posts, or using your information because they're going to be finding out what these two people have, have been doing. And this situation is going to come to an end because the Taurus, the big boss, the big person at the top could be leaving or going to jail. The Taurus, the big boss, the big person at the top could be leaving or going to jail. Okay. For the rest of you, um, some information is going to be coming. A Capricorn could be telling you something. Some deceptiveness is going to finally, finally come to an end. And it has to do with family money. It has to do with past life issue. Um, and some of you, um, there is going to be an issue coming up with money in the family. Okay, so you Pisces, there's going to be an issue with money coming up in the family. But this is going to be okay. But if you have a child that is a scorpion or an Aries, uh, be aware. It could be a wife. It could be an ex-wife for some of you. It could be your partner. Um, you got to be a, a, a weary of these two persons because whether they're your children, they're up to no good, and you got to get that. You got to connect this in the box before it reach any further. There is some judgment call. There is some information that is going to be coming out, and I want to know. What is the information? The information is going to be letting you know that this young scorpion has steal or access your information. Whoopsie daisy. Okay, 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 okay. So, something about a Gemini. A Gemini. A Gemini. You're going to be finding out something about a Gemini, okay? You were trying to figure out something about a Gemini, but this Gemini, very deceptive person, not a nice person. This Gemini, remember, Geminis have two faces. You could be in a relationship with this person. They, this Gemini have created all that is happening is created by this Gemini, okay? So you're going to be seeing the truth about this Gemini, okay? There is no love. It doesn't really matter. Um, but you're going to be finding out the truth about this Gemini because this Gemini, whoever this Gemini person is, they're the one who create all of this situation. I'm seeing really jail, jail time for the Taurus. Um, for some of you, not all of you, but I'm seeing jail time and it has to do with money. It has to do with asset property and that sort of a thing. A whole lot of people are going to be getting caught in a situation and they could be facing jail time. Um, not for all of you, but um, a lot of situation is transpiring where you Pisces are going to be protected because you're going to be, you have the strong foundation and you're going to be overcoming this. So if even they got you involved, whether it's your information they took or whatever, you're going to be coming out of this. Okay. You can have a partner you love, but don't forget all the other loves, such as friends, family, pet, and so on. So this is a wonderful um, message for you, Pisces. You can also have a partner that you love, okay? But don't forget your friends, family, pets, and so on. And that is so good because sometimes we're in relationship, we forget our friends, and our pets well pets no but partners friends you know that sort of a thing this is a good week for you um i don't see the energy of the sun but i see a situation that is ending with a taurus it could be a business situation so be careful you pisces and you pisces be careful with your business but you're going to be overcoming it you have a strong foundation it could be information about your business or something someone or they try to use your name to access um, certain things and they are going to be caught. Okay. Whatever these Aquarian and this, uh, this Aquarian and the Pisces have conjured up. <laughs> All righty. The Scorpio and the Aquarian has conjured up. They're about to see the back of the hands. Okay. 
so um again I want to say thank you so much you guys have been the winner this week I'm gonna um, let people know who are the winner last week the second week of September you have been the winner you Pisces I love you so much please share 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 these videos um, I know I'm straightforward I just don't have any time to read cards like the rest of people I don't read I channel so I give it as I see it and whatever message that needs to come out I just do it so please hold with me because I just channel ladies and gentlemen I can't sugarcoat things like the rest of the people like share these videos the full moon reading is coming out go check it out and remember this is the last month my readings are timeless you can always go back to my channel or go back to my website and check out whatever readings you want because maybe that message needs for you to come out at that time because we vibrate on different energy vibration I love you guys so much. Namaste until next time.